Oh, okay, all right guys, so we are out on a, a, like a little trout pond, kind of out in the backwoods, middle of nowhere. <sighs> My name is Kyle, welcome back to another episode of Wisconsin Fisherman. And whatever I just said, we're, we're, we're like set up in like a 10 foot radius. We're gonna put a tip down in the middle with a crappie minnow, and we're jigging for bluegills. So hopefully we can get a, get a big old pile of bluegill for dinner tonight, and uh, maybe some random fish mixed in. So enjoy. Rolling. Oh, you got a bite? Am I getting a bite? Okay, yep. I thought I had it last time. Set the hook and reel. Set the hook and reel. Okay, reel. There you go. Is it on there? Yep, she's got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. It's tiny. Look at that. Yeah. That's a keeper. <laughs> keeper and Kyle? That's, that's a keeper in Kyle's book. That's a slab right there. We're eating dinner. <laughs> Heck yeah. Nice job, Justine. <laughs> Look at that. The bobber just clips onto the line. Throw him down over here. Look at that. Nice. Ryan's like, see what's going on. Nothing's happening. I had a couple come up and hit it. But... Okay, so what I'm going to do now. Say, guy, you want to go try digging some water? Can you drill on a few more? Uh, if you want to pop one that way or that way, I'm going to set up the... I'm gonna set up the tip down. She's got a nice fish. That looks better. I'm gonna set up the, the tip down in the middle. What? <laughs> A <laughs> little better. Uh, what is that? <laughs> oh my god. You literally hooked me. I lost it because of this. Oh, you did have one though? Yeah. Oh, nice. I'm going to set the tip tip down up. Yeah. Oh, he's tiny disappeared. Right here. You got a fish? Yep. I got one that just came up. Mm -hmm. Little bluegill. Look at the guy coming on the screen. There's a bite. Oh gosh, this is a slab. <laughs> yes. Yes, guys. This is a slab. I can't believe I even caught that. People are like, why don't you post videos anymore? I'm like, well, you want to watch me catch dinks? I mean, if you want, Dink City. Got to weed through them, guys. That's the first part of fishing, right? You got to catch the little ones before you get to the big ones. See, Brian's just got big hooks over there so he can catch big ones. Oh, I think I need a different, something different. You need something different? I think I need something a little smaller. You want to go, you want to downsize? I think I'm scaring more of them off than them. All right, throw it over here. There it hit. Look at, oh God. Look at that pole bend. Look at that pole bend. You gotta be good. You gotta be good to catch a fish that big, guys. You gotta be good. I mean, he was at like 15 foot. He, a big old pike could have ate him up. What is that? Look at that bluegill, but it's like, it looks like a crappie. It's so purple. That's crazy. It's like a purple bluegill. But he looks like a crappie. That's a really cool looking fish. Little guy. <laughs> no, he's giant. <laughs> Nail him. Oh. Right off there. <sighs> little, little much. I'm putting the whole thing on. I'm not even going to cut it up. Just putting the whole thing on my hook. So if these bluegill are going to eat it, I guess they're going to suck it all the way up to the... Jesus! Right? I guess so. Why not? Let's see what happens. Oh my god. That might... A big gill might chow that down. <gasps> there we go. Oh. Look at that. See the plastic? Mm-hmm. They like that, huh? Oh, this is the first one. Fish on. Oh, guys. This is big. This is big. This is really big. It's big. Oh, yeah. It's a trout. I don't know what it is. Might be a bass. It's not, it's not taking off like a trout. It's kind of slow like a bass would be. Yeah. Bass. 
Sweet. I thought it was bigger, but from going catching a little tiny bluegill to that, I felt like a nice fish. Woohoo! Sweet. Ooh. Open. Oh my god. I thought this was a weed. Oh my god. It's a big bass, probably. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We got a tank right here. Tank, 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 tank. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's giant. Oh my god. I really want the big camera right now. It's in the backpack. Justin, can you run that big camera over in the backpack? <laughs> Does it have the fluffy thing on it? Yeah. Please don't come off. Oh, it came off! Did it really? Yes. Oh, you were too worried about the camera, Kyle. No, I was. Do <laughs> Wait. Yeah. No, it it came off, but it was giant. Let's just leave it at that. You want this? Yeah. Thank you. That was a huge. That was a huge fish. Probably why it came off, because you were hooked up on mine. It was a huge fish. Did you hear it running? Yeah. God, it was a giant. So we're still out here. Um, we're kind of popping around, found a couple, couple decenter bluegills there. Um, I had something giant on. And we're just kind of on the shoreline, right here from the shoreline to here. It's uh, 16 foot where we're at, and 20 foot from the shoreline over here to where they're at, so it's pretty, straight drop with about 20 foot across and a little bit more of a dip down into there. But um, we're, we're steady bluegill fishing is what it is, but they're small. Brian's caught some bass. And he's caught some bass, yeah, so pretty good. I wish I caught that giant one, I don't know. But she's gonna come over here fishing this hole, hopefully catch some nice keepers. We're gonna pop around a little bit more and maybe go deeper, shallower. Don't know, we'll figure it out. Oh, nice. Is that a keeper? Can't a keep bigger. it. Season's closed. Uh, can I take a picture of you with it? No. Up. Doubled. <laughs> Doubled up. On tanks. Did you see that one eat it on the screen? Oh really? Down viewing? Recording? Yep. Nice. Did your bobber go with tug tug? Nice. I'm glad we all have muck boots on. Yeah, where do yours like stop being dry? Ours are not muck. Mine stopped being dry right here. Right here. Right here. Oh, I thought they had foam pieces on the back. No? The suits? No? No? Mine have foam pieces on the bottom of the track. No, no, no. She's talking the foam. Like on the side, like where it's not. So. See, mine starts getting foamy right here. But the foam is neoprene, just like waders are made out of. Oh, okay. Okay. I bought a really crappy pair of waders, and they originally said I wore them, and I was going to return them. And they went back to the car, and then I went to the army, and they dropped forever. Uh, oh, tip down! Ho, 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 ho! Uh, he'll be up in a minute. Oh. Ah. Please be a giant. Oh, it's a bass. Oh. He's got it down there, too. He choked it. I just like looked up, and the tip down's like, ah! Just a little guy, but uh, he's got it down there. I know. Yeah. Hey, guys. Welcome back. This is the end of the video. Um, we caught lots of bluegills, a lot of small ones, and a couple decent ones. I think we kept seven, and you know, enough for a meal, I guess. But uh, so they're gonna head back to the hometown, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna call it a night. Did you guys have fun? Yeah, it was a good yeah, time. It's a good time. It's good. You had fun watching the fish on the Aquaview. Perfect. All right, guys. So uh, like always, hit the subscribe button wherever it is. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.